Okay, books. Check. People to talk about books. Check. Cheese. Hi readers, welcome back to Six Picks. I'm Emma. And I'm Abby. And today we are thinking about book clubs. It's the beginning of a new year and so we're thinking about what our book club is going to read all year long. And so we wanted to give you some great ideas for your own book club. My first pick is The Idiot by Elif Bachman. This is a book that you and I both love. We really did. It's a very heartfelt and sneakily funny story about a young woman named Celine. Uh, it follows her on her first year of college at Harvard in 1995. And I think the coming of age story and Celine's quest to find her identity will really spark a conversation at book club. My first pick is My Sister the Serial Killer by Oyinkin Braithwaite. This book follows two sisters in Nigeria, and sisters always have each other's backs, except this pair is a little different. The eldest sister is always cleaning up her younger sister's messes, except her younger sister is a serial killer who's constantly just, whoops, killing her boyfriends. This book is darkly comic, and we guarantee that your book club will absolutely devour it. My next pick is A Wilderness Station by Alice Munro. This is a collection of stories that spans 30 years in Alice Munro's career, and it reads almost like a survey course in her writing. Uh, her writing is so beautiful and compact and intricate, and I think that short stories are always a great choice for book club because if like in my book club, you have a lot of delinquents, they can read one or two stories and still participate in the discussion. My second pick is Those Who Knew by Idranovi. This book is a thriller. It's very suspenseful and centers on Lena, who is older now, but remembers a dalliance she once had with a senator during her student activist days. She has a hunch that the woman who's been introducing him at rallies is being taken advantage of by the senator. And she wonders whether or not she should come forward with the information that she knows about this very powerful man. My final pick is Black Leopard, Red Wolf by Marlon James. I'll be honest, I picked this book because I want my book club to read it. It is the first in a planned trilogy by the Man Booker um, award-winning author of A History of Seven Killings. And it has been dubbed an African Game of Thrones, which I totally get that as a touch point, but it's also entirely its own thing. And if your book club sometimes has trouble stepping into different genres, I think this is a great way in because Marlon James has such a wonderful literary pedigree, but he's also doing something cool and speculative and fantasy sci-fi. My final pick is The Dreamers by Karen Thompson Walker. Woo. Now, you know I'm obsessed with Karen Thompson Walker's first book, The Age of Miracles, and this is also a gorgeous, speculative novel. It's sort of like a modern midsummer's night dream. It takes place in a sleepy college town in Southern California when a first year student goes into her dorm, falls asleep, and cannot be woken up. She can't be woken up by her roommate, May. She can't be woken up by the paramedics or doctors. Everyone is extremely confused by what is going on. And then a second student starts falling asleep and can't be woken up, and a third, and soon doctors are realizing that these people sleeping have really increased brain activity. They're having wild dreams, but of what? I won't spoil it for you, but this novel will definitely make your book club discuss what really goes on while we sleep. And of course, the most important part of book club is choosing the snacks. Box. Do you think we left anything out? Let us know in comments below or tweet at us at Read It Forward. And for more great book picks, sign up for our weekly newsletter at readitforward.com slash subscribe. <laughs>